obviously this is not your <laughs> typical relationship. And Sherry, I know you don't mind me saying you're 50. Desmond, you're 26. I'm sure you don't have a yeah. problem with me saying that. Let me ask you, with family no, no, and friends sure. and even strangers pushing back on your love life because of that age difference, and I'll start with you, Sherry, why put it out there on TV? You know, that's a great question, and I really did give it great consideration. Um, I'm really not interested in having my personal life <laughs> reviewed on camera. However, after I spoke with uh, Fiona Kennedy, our executive producer, uh, she was definitely coming from the standpoint of empowering women and wanting to change <clears throat> consciousness and move women forward. And I'm all about taking a little heat for anything that will break open barriers for women and allow us to have relationships as men has have always had with respect for any age differences. All so, right, so, so you're doing it for I, a cause. I, I can totally appreciate that. And obviously you embrace the cougar title. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you know, the word has different connotations. For me, um, it means an empowered, intelligent woman that lives life on her own terms. That's how I interpret it. Okay, yeah, you don't look very predatory to me. Uh, but Desmond, let me get your take on how your family reacted when you first told them about Sherry and this age difference that was going on there. Well, the interesting thing is that uh, I actually introduced Sherry on the show um to my entire family um and uh i think at first there was a little bit of shock there but uh ultimately they ended up accepting and, and loving her i mean it's been great um so uh, the family has been very supportive well that's no that's good yeah. to hear and hey look what is yeah. television for if if not to use it to introduce your companion to your family <laughs> I mean, the producers must have oh, loved you for that oh but, yeah hey Sh Sherry, what, you know, what do you say to the naysayers because obviously there are some people who just don't get it and, and you are educating sure, in a way sure. what, do you, what do you tell those people you know i say you're absolutely entitled to your opinion you can feel however you feel um here's the thing love comes from the soul you know and it's really beyond age race and gender and so if you're not inside of what i'm experiencing and what i'm feeling i can understand where it may appear odd but um, once you feel that type of connection on a soul level it really goes beyond all of those barriers that